What is up, guys? This is Justin, a.k.a. FMDG, and I'm here with part two of my United States Pyramid Flip experiment. Um, we're going to check out 30 years in the future. Um, we're going to start out 30 years, probably end up at 50 years. Um, so, yeah, let's get into it. All right, guys, welcome back. As you can see, 1st of July, 2049. I have not looked at any of this. Let's check out the Premier League. Greek American Atlas still getting things done, but some of the uh, big dogs coming up strong. So we left off here uh, 10 years ago, 3039. New York Red Bulls going on a run. I mean, granted, New York is the football mecca right now. Um, a few of our teams are back. Detroit City. Loving that. Um, getting in there, you know, just. It is a good mix. I mean, Polonia Melicic. You guys have heard me butcher that name several times. Titans. I mean, they've had a pretty good run, too. Let's look at their history. Nope. Eat that. They've been in the Premier League the whole time. Okay. Well, shows what I know. Um. Yeah. Uh, let's see. So Atlanta. Uh, actually, let's look at New York Red Bulls. So, I mean, look at this rise up. Oof. <laughs> That's a decent 14-year period right there. Um, where they start here in the Pacific National League, work their way up. Promotion, promotion, promotion. Instant promotions every year. Premier League. And they guys have gone right up the ladder. That's That's awesome. 1.4 billion. I do want to see um, what Greek American Atlas is valued at. 2 billion. That is so freaking cool. That is so freaking cool. A team that, you know, was in the bottom of the tier. Uh, Champions League. They got four of those. That's cool. Um, that is so cool to see. Um, but yeah, let's go through uh, Premier League. See how everyone's getting on there. Um, 30, 39. We'll look at all the seasons. You can pause um, any of these. But yeah, I mean, look at these teams. It's a good mix of teams that started out here when we flipped it, and then teams have worked their way back. Um, New York City running away with that one. Dominating performances there. Sounders. Getting uh, relegated. I mean, we're having the same big three. Oh, Polonia getting in there, getting in the mix of the big three. This is so cool to see. Let's see what else. Take them to the current. Uh, that was the most current season. Let's go to the championship, see who's still around in there. Sounders are having a bit of a tough time. Let's go look at them. Yeah, their competition going only valued at $48 million. They started in the Southern National League, moved up, moved up, got to the Premier League, and now bouncing back and forth between the championship and the Premier League. That's not good for them. That's unfortunate. It's not getting the love that they should be having. Had him in a save not too long ago. Sworn I had him. Hmm, that name sounds familiar. Let's look at League One. Let's see where that one is. The teams in here. Getting some of the Academy teams showing up. Uh, Phoenix Rising. Let's see. My local Phoenix Rising. How are they doing? They started in Pacific National League. Their way up. So this is as high as they've been in League One. They've been a League One team for 10 years now. Come on, Rising, let's go. Um, yeah, a bunch of Academy teams going to League Two. Again, a bunch of Academy teams and some affiliates. Affiliates. Philadelphia Fury having a tough time getting up. Any other the Premier League teams? Not really. Just 
look at Philly, see how they've how their history's gotten on. They're just a strong League One, League Two team. Okay. Let's look into the Northern or National Premier. And this is pretty much about what it you know was when we started. Nothing exciting there. See anyone super movement one way or, or the other. Look in Division One. Um, Madison, if you're watching my uh, Hitchhiker series, Madison means something. Let's check out their little history here. They started in the Mountain National League, moved up to Premier League, League Two, so bouncing around there. Uh, let's look here, Division Two. Looks like all the big teams have gotten out for sure. See them hanging around. I'm curious what the lowest level um, Premier League club is. Normal Premier League club. Go through these a little bit quicker. No one's jumping out. And these are the bottom tier. So most of these clubs, like let's look here. Um, pick one Minnesota Twin Stars. Where did they start out with? They started out in the National Premier and have relegated themselves down here. I mean, typically finishing last in their divisions. A couple of good ones. But that's only once they get into the lower tier here. Um, I'm going to guess most of, the, most of the clubs have kind of Figured it all out. Um, don't see any big names in here. Southern Valley. Okay, now let's look at the FA Cup. Uh, history here. Past winners. I don't know if we've looked at this much. So, yeah, I mean, he's United again in the first year. I mean, that's some of the big clubs still making way in there. Um, I don't think we've been very good looking at this. Uh, let's see. I mean, the big dogs are definitely winning in, you know, the established clubs, Detroit City. I, I love that. You guys have been following my Hitchhiker series. You know, I'm a big fan of Detroit City FC. Um, I mean, they just got promoted right out the chute and have stayed there ever since. Well done. Well done. Le Rouge. Let's look at transfers. Um, Premier League transfer history. Big money fees coming in. I mean, so they're they're selling some good players, bringing in some decent players in this current year. Um, big money there. American making some big money. How are they doing with their cat or with their uh, training and youth? They have any affiliated clubs? Nobody. So they're homegrown. That's that's good to see. I do want. Let's look at their transfer history. Um, look at that. They're bringing in the box. And this would be a decent little save to start with these guys and maybe see what you can do. They might have some potential. I mean, who knows? If you're using my database. Do a save, Greek American Atlas. Let me know how that goes. I mean, look at this. I mean, granted, we did make some weird stuff happen, but I do want to see this 31 32 season. It sold 300 million worth of players. That's impressive. That is impressive. Um, go back and look at some more of these. I mean, so we got a lot of money coming in and out of US. That's good. Um, I also do want to check, see how the U.S. team is doing. Not bad. Tenth in the world. <clears throat> I mean, some of the best players are here in Cincinnati. I like seeing that. Um, let's look at the national club. Seeing where the players are. We've got a few. Quite a few of them are staying home. I like that. Uh, let's look at history of the national winning the gold cup. 
not doing too much with World Cup competition. Let's look and see. Ooh, third place playoff, second round, third place playoff. <clears throat> Nothing much in terms of that. While we're here, let's look at World Cup and see who's winning that. Germany, England, England. Wow. You guys in England must be happy about seeing that. Um, good to see. Okay, let's. Uh, we're about 10 minutes in. Let's go ahead 40 years and see where we end up. All right, guys, welcome back. It is July 1st, 2059. A bajillion years in the future. Lots of jobs open. Let's go look. Um, profile, American. Can I click that? There we go. I just wanted to get here. Um, just kind of get a look. US rank eighth in the world. Um, since we're here, let's look at their competitions. World Cup, have we done anything in the last 10 years? Third round, quarterfinal, nothing, nothing of interest there. We'll look here at the Premier League, see how it's been going. New York domination. Um, Greek American Atlas kind of fallen off a little bit. I mean, they're still in there. Recently finished fourth. It looks like most of the teams are back. Baltimore Colts, Titans, Militish, Carpathia, Irish Americans. So a good mix of the teams that started out there and then the normal Premier League clubs coming back in. Um, look at the championship. Ooh, so we got a couple more. Oh, Detroit City got relegated and barely just missed out on getting promoted back up in the playoffs. Let's see, um, Columbus Crew in here, Sounders. Couple of the Premier League sides still lingering down in the lower tiers. Uh, let's see. I don't see any more of the lower of the Premier League sides in here. If you see one, holler at me. One. I'm sorry. Wait, did I just do a big one? Yeah, I did. Okay. I'm asleep. Sorry. Um, and I know that Atlanta that shows up, that is not Atlanta United. Different one. Let's look here at the National Premier League. Again, academy team is running away with these. So everything looks to be getting sort of back to normal um, with these lower division sides. You know what I would love? I would love to see someone take my database, remove all the affiliations with the academies and everything, and then um, kind of see how everything turns out. I have not done that. Maybe that'll be my, well, maybe maybe that'll be me. Maybe I'll do that, um, kind of do some simulations, and maybe that'll be my next experiment video. Comment down below if you think that's a good idea. Uh, let's go. National Division Two. I mean, these are pretty much all the clubs who should be there. I think everything is getting sorted just the way it should be. <clears throat> Not spend too much time going through these. Yep. Southeastern. No one really looking out of ordinary. I would have been interesting to see if the, one of the old school Premier League clubs got stuck down here or one of the championship sides, but I don't think anyone did. Movement in here. Now let me do this. Actually, I really wish to heck that I could maintain that uh, where it shows the league table. <clears throat> Yeah, I don't see anyone. Oops. Nope. Nope. Wrong click. Hmm. Yeah, it looks like everyone's sort of Kansas City Academy. I think they were a little bit higher up when we started, or in you know non bef non flipped. Valley will be the last one. 
one looks to be decent here. Let's look at the FA Cup. Who's gotten on in the last few years? You know, so some of the good now established Premier League sides um, taking that trophy. <clears throat> I did forget to look at the League Cup and the National Cup before. <clears throat> More of the same, you know. Those are going to be fluctuating if teams go up and down the leagues. But here, this will probably be won mainly by Premier League sides and some championship sides. Detroit City getting their win a few years ago. Uh, let's look again at some where some of the national team players are playing. <clears throat> Greek, kind of all over. Not a good mix. A uh, good run of American clubs there. Yeah, I'd say it's about 50-50 America and then outside America. Look at some of these transfers again. 100 million going out. We're bringing some players in. We're swapping them around the kind of United States. Oh. Uh, where do I, I don't want to see that. 58. Uh, that's not what I want to see. Um. Let's do this. Premier League, you can go to transfer histories there. There we go. That's a little bit easier to see. Bringing in some, <clears throat> selling a lot there. A lot of guys going out. First three. Money still being made. Greek American still doing well. Um, what else can we look at? <clears throat> Let's look here at some of the world players. Uh, world award winners. Ballon d'Ors. Um, have not looked at this. Anyone from any clubs. I mean, we got a guy here from Greek American. Oh, he's retired at 36. Decent little career. Any other Ballon d'Ors coming from here? I mean, just one is impressive enough. Another one from Greek America. Nice. It looks like Barcelona is the team to be in the future. Doubt too much of this. Uh, best men's goal goalkeeper. Any American sides here? Greek American, Greek American. Same guy. Okay. I mean, Greek American is in the contention for best. American club in this series so far in this save. Oh yeah, just a bunch of Greek American. Ben's best player, twenty one. Imagine they're gonna have a few. We got some Red Bulls in here. A few more Americans in here, so that's good. At least we're generating some good young talent. Where did this guy end up? Playing. Oh, he's a part of Hawaiian national. Bounced around. And he had a decent career. 301 appearances. And play kind of all over DM. Striker attacking. Not bad. 705 average rating. Coming up through. Let's see who. Uh, Jorge Fernandez here. He's at City. Good career. With Inter Milan, Inter Miami, and then Greek American. I mean, they're making. They're, I mean, they're getting some good players coming through the ranks, and the youth um, player of the year. Rallo again, seeing him in there. Uh, let's look here. Team of the year. Um, any Americans on there? Oh. Oh, right, running away last year, 58, 57. Some decent guys from New York City in there. Good to see. Good to see. I like seeing some of, you know, this is, this is why I build the database, to see if America could keep up with the rest of the world. All right, let's go ahead and now check 50 years. That'll finalize this, um, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, we are July 1st, 2069, 50 years in the future. Um, 
Let's see where we got on. Look, USA. Look it. Come on. Okay. Today's ranked eighth in the nation in the world. Not a lot going on there. Um, was curious to see how this is kind of the longest I've done a, uh, a save using my own database, even though you know, I'd flip it around. I do want to see how they've gotten on with some of the, um, so if the USA has had better success now, 50 years in, um, not that much. I mean, continental success, yes, like we've always decent at. World Cup, still. Olympics, lost in the finals, quarterfinal, 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 third place. Not really the success I would have liked to have seen. Um, go back here, look in the Premier League. I'm getting on. Uh, Greek American, good. Had a good little run there again, uh, finding their success. Los Angeles finally ending the reign of New York. I mean, look at this. If you look at the past winners, a New York side has won it every single year. I might look at this athletic union. They're still in the PL. Where are they located at? Facilities here in New York. So a New York State team has won the Premier League every single year. I'm reading this right, except for this most current year where LA broke the tie. They finally got through. I mean, and they were even coming in second most years. You know, Orlando, Atlanta, LA. That's pretty freaking impressive. Where is Polonia located? They're in Chicago. Okay, I think I knew that. Okay, let's see what else. Um, I mean, that's impressive. LA finally getting breaking through. Estimate value of two point one billion. Greek American. Oh, they're down a little. I think they were two billion before. They're one just under one point four. FIFA Club World Cup. Oh, I love that. I love that. I I kind of want to do a save with these guys. I do that on my own. If you guys do a save with them, let me know how it goes. I'm very curious. Um, I want to look at their history. Look at that. They have been the club to come out of this for sure. I'm loving that. Domestic leagues. I mean, they never left the Premier League. I mean, their worst finish was at sixth, ninth. I mean, aside from these six years, they finished fourth every year, fourth or better. That's awesome. That's cool to see. Rags to riches. So let's see. Anyone else? Baltimore Colts in here. They're not normally a Premier League side, but they have stayed in. They started in the championship, worked their way mid table most of the way. So, I mean, not too bad. Uh, who else is still around here? Titans, I believe they started in the Premier League as well. A couple bounce backs. Um, let's look at Colonia. They started in the Premier League as well. Stayed in the entire time. Established club. Uh, Carpathi, Carpathia. Probably another one of those clubs that has always been in here. Uh, bounce back there. Yeah, they started in there. So, I mean, it's interesting to see Athletic Union. Where did they start out? They started Premier League, had some bounce. They've been kind of bouncing back and forth. And then lastly, I saw uh, Houston Hurricane, another team. Started in Premier League, worked their way up, have bounced back and forth between the championship. But it's it's interesting to see. So we've got what Greek American, Baltimore, Titans, Polonia, Carpathia, Athletic, Houston. So we've got seven clubs from the original um, you know, flip who have maintained, and then the rest of the clubs all work their way back. So thirteen of the originals, uh, or the original um, I'll say the normal Premier League side clubs have I'd wander back in. I'd be willing to see that they're probably mostly the other seven are probably in here. Houston, New England, uh, Philly, Columbus, Sounders. Yeah, it looks like they're they're all in here. Um, Detroit City. Come on, guys. 
Let's get in. And they were League One, worked their way up. They've had a good good run. I mean, they're worth only eighty three million. You know my love for Detroit City. Uh, Phoenix Rising, my local club. They've had in the league. They've had some success. They're working their way up. I would like to see them do a little bit better in this save from real life. But it looks like everyone else kind of ended up there. Um, don't need to really go through the leagues too much more or transfers. It looks like after about 30 to 40 years, everything sort of got figured out with some teams establishing themselves in the divisions they started in. So that's really cool to see. I'm really excited about the Greek American. Um, that is that is a that is a cool cool story. They have done super well for themselves. Um, let me look at this financially. Icoons <laughs> floated on the stock market. So that helps out. Um, Moved to a new stadium, relocated Red Bull Arena. We look at that. Now they're in the same with six, almost 65,000. That is so cool to see. Is that where they are now? Hold up. Where are they at now? Oh, Lee Canyon Park. <laughs> Must have been one of their. So cool. Let's look and see. See him in any of their legends. Why would they name a park after him if he's not one of their all time legends? Interesting. Six year sponsorship. Is he a coach? Oh, you know, I kind of want to look at that too. I had Jermaine Jones there for 17 years. Holy cow. Blazer comes in. I mean, yeah, many Christmas. That's awesome. That is fantastic. Is he still around doing anything? Nope. 67. Retired. Um, he was boots. Good coach. Let's see. He did that. Went to Carpath Carpathia. Nice job, Jermaine Jones. That's cool. Uh, let's see who else stayed with them for a while. I mean, they've bounced around, but then this Connor Bennett has been around for a while. Regend, Nugend. Uh, what other history they have? Records. You let's look here. I mean, so they finished the worst they did is ninth. Yeah, most points in a season 111, 54. That's so cool. That is so cool seeing that. That's for his highest transfer fee you received. Wow. Miguel Martin to Chelsea. He did pretty well for them. Chelsea for a while ended up at Leicester. Overall goals by a player. Is this in a season? Has to be because he's got way more goals than that, and he's actually currently there. Nice stash too. Um, wins in a row, twenty-seven, fifty-five without a loss. Worst run is five loss, four losses in a row. I mean, that is good. That's cool to see. And it says, "Look at that! That jump right there. That's when they went big time." Right there. Well, it's wrong. What else do I want to see here? I'm I'm just intrigued by these guys, by this this club in particular. This is the hero of the series for sure. Um, let's just look at to see who else has won. Um, how Champions League has gone on. I don't want to make this too long. Um, but since uh, you guys may be interested in seeing 
I'll take a quick look here. I won't really spend too much time. It's the usual suspects. Um, curious to see how many of these clubs are. Uh, let's see. I want to see how many of the winners of these clubs. I guess it'd be kind of hard to see our American. Um, let's go here and see how many of them. Ooh, Holland. Um, how many of them are American? Any of these top guys, Americans? Interesting to see if we have any real success. Oh, there we go. There we go. John Wallace. Let's look at him. Currently in Barcelona, doing well for them. This is why I wanted to see. You know, how are these guys getting on? It's awesome American players. Adam going for ninety nine million. I mean. World beater right here. Good. Anyone else? I think that's kind of the current. All right, so we just had one American break into the Champions League Golden Boot Award. Um, no, that's kind of cool to see. Um, if you guys want to see anything else, comment below. Maybe I can do a follow-up a footnote episode to this. But I think we'll end it there. We're going on about half an hour. Thank you guys so much. That was the second part of my experiment series, flipping the United States Pyramid around. Um, very interesting to see. I'm really... Really liking that uh, Greek American Atlas Club, seeing how they uh, maintained their position in the Premier League once we did the flip, and were a world dominating force. Really, that was so cool to see. But if you haven't already subscribed, please consider throwing me a subscribe. Hit the notification notification icon next to that to be notified when I do post new videos, and smash that like button. Um, I appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. Have a great rest of your day.